Hey, Crossroads fans, coming up August 21st, there's a total solar eclipse that will sweep across a narrow band of the United States, and Nashville, Tennessee is directly in its path. On Eclipse Day, the Tennessee Crossroads crew will be live at the Adventure Science Center. We will be streaming a special eclipse event on our Tennessee Crossroads Facebook page starting at 1 p.m. If you are in the path of totality, we want you to experience this once-in-a-lifetime solar event. But in order to safely view the eclipse, you need to know a couple of things. A simple rule of safety is it's never safe to look directly at the sun. You'll need a pair of certified solar eclipse glasses or another indirect viewing method to safely observe the sun. If you are in the path of totality like we are in Nashville, you will have a chance to watch a total solar eclipse. The next one won't hit Nashville for more than 500 years, so it's a big deal. In Nashville, the moon will begin to partially eclipse the sun at about noon. If you are outside the path of totality, you'll always need solar eclipse glasses to look up at the sun or another indirect viewing method such as a pinhole projector. Punch a hole in a piece of cardboard Hold it up to the sun and then look down at the light passing through the hole. You will see a projected image of the partial eclipse. Now for the fun stuff. Here is what to expect to see if the sky is clear in Nashville on August 21st. Starting at about noon in Nashville, the moon will begin to eclipse the sun. That crescent sun will get smaller and smaller as we approach totality. Just before totality, you will see the direct light of the sun as it shimmers over the valleys of the moon. It's called Bailey's Beads. Pretty cool stuff. Then just before 127 in Nashville, you will see the diamond ring. That's the last bit of direct light peeking around the moon. It's almost time for the real show, totality. During a total eclipse, which only lasts a minute and 55 seconds in Nashville, you can take off your solar eclipse glasses and put down your pinhole projector. The moon is completely blocking the surface of the sun. Cross your fingers for clear skies and you will be able to see the sun's corona, which is normally not visible because of the bright sunlight. It will be nighttime in Music City during the middle of the day. The temperature will drop and you might even see nature adjust to the sudden darkness. And then totality is over. You'll need your certified solar eclipse glasses or indirect viewing method again to view the remaining partial phase as the eclipse continues its path towards the southeast. I hope you'll take advantage of this once in a lifetime event and join me on the Tennessee Crossroads Facebook page starting at 1 p.m. Central Time August 21st, as we count down to the All-American Total Eclipse of 2017, I will see you under the shadow.